Hello there guys, it's Mauricio the Argentine guy 2003 here, and it's been 3 months ago since I've made my true and honest feelings, and my true and honest feelings series is finally back. Today, I'm doing my true and honest feelings about Animator Extraordinary Transforming Worlds. And before I start the video, if any of you guys still like him or you guys are neutral to him, then I strongly recommend you guys to cut ties with him for good and you cannot trust him at all, I'm not trying to bash your opinion, it is just an advice. Anyways, let's get started, shall we folks? Animator Extraordinary Transforming Worlds is nothing but a school shooter joker, I used to like him back in April 2023 and I started to hate him in October 2023, I will give you the reasons why you can't trust Animator Extraordinary Transforming Worlds. 1. He wish a happy anniversary to the Sandy Hook Elementary School shooting, proving he is disrespectful to those who died in that school shooting. 2. He doxxed two users, which were at the Meme Master Spongebob Gaming, in which he can get arrested. 3. He said THRN word on his rant on the Wiggles in 2021, proving he is a racist jerk, not to mention that he did the same thing as Sean Sullivan back in 2020, even though Sean is a dead topic. 4. He sent dead threats, proving he's heartless. 5. He abuses the copyright system, he should know that the copyright system is used for giving people true copyright strikes and he could get his channel terminated for what he did. 6. He claims that he hates ages of consent, proving he supports pedophilia, and also, Age of consent is important to protect minors. 7. He fakes his apologies just so that people can like him again, which will never happen. 8. He shared CP on his community tab or but was naked, in which sharing CP is illegal and he can get arrested for it. 9. He committed CP on a video where Kalu and Little Bill got held back three years ago, and like what I said, committing CP can get him arrested and he's now confirmed a pedophile. 10. He can't handle hate nor criticism, not even surprised. 11. He deleted his apology video all because denied it, proving he can't handle hate. 12. He is a hypocrite, because he claims to hate criminals, pedophiles, CP and doxxing, yet he actually does it those categories. 13. He claims that making multiple apology posts counts as faking an apology when it doesn't, it's not like we should never make mistakes ever again. No. No one is perfect, everyone makes mistakes. 14. He takes trolls way too seriously. 15. He hates Wilson the Revenge Master for taking trolls way too seriously, yet he does the same thing, what a hypocrite. 16. He lost interest on apology videos all because Aiden Productions Films made multiple apology posts, proving he wants users to never make mistake ever again, proving he cannot handle mistakes, although Aiden Productions isn't any better. 17. He hates apologizing, proving he's heartless. 18. He takes the HXR way too seriously when the HXR users are just trolls who are meant to be ignored. 19. On his top 20 users list, he put trolls such as Yankees Base Below 3, at Saddam at Shake, Super Saud the Irish Pakistani Boy 2005 and other users higher than the pedophiles he put proving he treats trolls like they were worse than pedophiles. 20. He treats trolling like it's worse than Hitler, although I'm neutral to trolling. 21. He lied about the Vian community too many times. 22. He never left the Vian community. 23. He claims that he's no longer in the Vian community, yet he kept talking about it too many times. What a hypocrite. 24. He's stuck in the Vian community forever. Once you enter the Vian community, you can never escape, and the Vian community will also never improve, it's North Korea hell altogether. 25. He lied about leaving the drama community. How you may ask, because he made true and honest feelings out of innocent users, but what the hey, the good news that he finally retired his true and honest feeling series. 26. When everybody started losing hatred on Zern 999 and found out that they were brainwashed by hate of the New York Viander 2004 THR whole time, he refused to lose hatred on him all because it's Zern 999 and still hates him, proving he can't handle hate. 
27, he lied about moving on from all users he hates and unproved his true and honest feelings about Super Saw the Irish Pakistani Boy 2005 The Top 20 Worst Users Video Where He Put Him As His Number 1 Worst User Ever. 28, when Foxy and Oz improved and everybody started to losing hatred on them, he refused to lose hatred on Step Down Gian Shadow and Step Down Vinny all because they still hate him. Proving he cannot handle hate. 29. He lied about leaving YouTube on January 31, 2024. 30. He claims that he hates liars, when he lied about leaving YouTube himself, what a hypocrite. 31. And finally, he claims that pedophiles deserve death, yet he doesn't act like it, because he called Super Sod the Irish Pakistani boy 2005 out for sending HHHH go animate a death threat which he's also a pedophile because he made a post out of Split FDI 2024 as a characters named Mandora and Fora who are both 145 in the actual series and he threatened to cut off Lola J's private parts when Lola is only 14. And Vinny, if you are watching this, I am ass say till the cube done with you permanently, you blew up all your chances, and I actually mean it, for real, and you are ever blocked from my channel. And I wanna give a credit to Super Saw the Irish Pakistani Boy 2005 and everyone for the reasons why Animator Extraordinary Transforming Worlds can be trusted. But anyways, that's all I have to say. If you have a community tab, please share this video. This is Miracle the Argentine Guy 2003, signing off.